Bass Tactics 01 and uh, today I'll be showing you my um, my gear that I take with me and have with me all at all times besides my poles and I just keep these in the back of uh, my trunk and my Camry so first off I'm going to start you with the left side which I have my this uh, uh, extra extra pair of shorts first aid kit a little umbrella and that's it for over there and then we get into the the heart of my soft plastics which I keep all of them in this little bin right here from uh, crawl fatties to uh, drop shot worms uh, bush crawls senkos 10 inch worms uh, Four inch flukes, five inch flukes, six inch Senkos, just a whole variety of different baits in here. Now next up, we have in uh, <clears throat> this little bucket, I just keep a uh, line, uh, 25 pound fluorocarbon and 30 pound fluorocarbon. Now in the uh, big red, the red tote. That's where I keep all my uh, boxes, all my Plinko boxes, and swim baits, uh, uh, water bottle, um, mosquito wipes. Very important. Um, crank baits, square bills, a couple jerk baits. Uh, jig box, frog box, uh, buzz baits, a couple chatter baits, and uh, a bunch of um, spinner baits. Uh, just two two top water baits in here: a whopper plopper and a hula popper, and then uh, rattle traps. And now we get into the uh, bread and butter of the uh, part of the video, which are my uh, some of my uh, some of my rods that I have with me. Uh, I have my uh, my lose. I don't know the exact number. SS G1H paired up with a Shimano. Uh, I believe it's uh, Celis worm and jig rod with. 30 pound braid. Next up, we have the um, 10 pound monofilament on a Cabela's Prodigy rod with a, uh, what is it? Uh, Strike King Mad Dog, I believe. Basically, just a spook. And then, uh, one is my, uh, I use this one as my wacky worm uh, setup. It's a uh, Lose MC5 laser uh, with a uh, Lose Carbon ZR speed stick with, uh, what is it, 10 pound uh, monofilament line. <clears throat> really smooth. I really do like this one as well as the 13 fishing one. And I just got this too. I really recommend it a nice one but it is it is a little pricey 175 for the real but it's definitely pretty sweet and last but not least we have a uh, Gander Mountain Vortex 6'6 six six, paired up with a uh, new tech 4 inch swim jig on here and then a uh, just a little Shakespeare deceiver rod is one of my first bait casters but it is pretty nice though cast real smooth and I believe this is 12 pound uh, monofilament line that's it overall pretty nice setup but 
for a Camry. I mean, it's not. It's just a little four-door car, but. Gotta make do with what you have. Thank you for watching Bass Tactics 01. Signing out. Remember to like, subscribe, and comment. And stay tuned for more fishing videos.